All right, so in an instance where maybe our brake switches aren't working um, and we're not able to start the scooter electrically, uh, we can actually kickstart the vehicle. That's a feature found on a lot of 50cc scooters. So what you need to do in order to make that possible is you definitely have to turn the key to the on position. So you know I showed you how to do that just a little bit ago. Turn that key to the on position and then um, you just pull this little lever out right here, a little kickstart lever. And you don't have to like start stomping on it. That's a very common mistake. People start, you know, slamming on it and they get frustrated. Um, you know, you want to just kind of rest your foot on it to where it grabs that gear. What I typically do is stand straight up on the back of the scooter like this. Um, and then I just kind of hold on to the back rack, put my foot on it to where it grabs that gear, and then I just press through until it starts. Just like that. Now, obviously if it's a little colder or the scooter hasn't been running in a while, it may not start on the first kick like that. But if you just kind of let rest your foot to where it is grabbing that gear and you just pump it several times, it should crank over. And that's another way to get you started in case your battery were dead or if the one of the you know one of the brake switches and the brake handles weren't working.